Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Monkey Wrench. I'm Kelly, the monkey with the wrench. Today I'm going to do a quick show and tell of my new blower. I've been wanting electric for a long time. I've been using it now for about two weeks, and today we're going to show it to you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I appreciate it. I do everything with my bike. I take this back and forth down to the south side of my town every day where I keep my big equipment. I happen to be on the north side today and I have to cut two of them today by hand. But it's lightweight. It's got the little pipe on it. I keep two batteries here in the trunk. I have done extensive testing. I actually filmed the video on this and then deleted it because it was way too long. A two amp hour battery gets 14 minutes run time nonstop on the low setting. I got the cheaper version, which was smaller, and it did the same thing, 14 minutes, and it didn't have as much power. So I have two of these batteries, they're two amp hours each, and I get about 27 to 29 minutes of run time. And after I cut today's lawn, I'm gonna show you that you don't have to be afraid of using an electric blower. I've gotta blow all this off. There's a porch in the back. This little stone area. And then there's sidewalk and porch up around the other side of the house. And then we're gonna do the other house as well. I'm gonna do two houses on one battery. I'm gonna show you how strong it is. And I'm gonna show you that there's still plenty of power left. So I'm just gonna blow this off. Do me a favor, somebody time it. And tell me how long it takes in the comments. And keep in mind with this property she has a serious leaf problem she pays minimum to have the lawn cut and does not want to clean the leaves or at least pay to have it done so I just do the bulk of my dirt Showing you real time here.
and that's on the low setting it has a higher setting and the blower will run for about half the half the time on the lower setting as it does on the high but the low is perfect for what i do got more than enough power on low to blow everything clean from all your clippings and whatnot and on average I get between two and three houses blown on one two amp hour battery or about 14 minutes runtime is basically all I'm doing is making sure that the the driveways and the sidewalks and everything are clean when I'm done. I don't know if you can see it, but the fire department's down there. There's a guy, he's a scrapper, a junker, and his whole lawn is probably as big as this, and it's covered in every kind of crap you could think of. The city finally put violations on him, and now apparently he caught his house on fire. So they're out there dealing with that. Always something with some people in it. According to the neighbors, the dryer set off the fire. YouTube. And that's it. That's the whole property. So we'll get to the second one here in a minute. Now I don't have my tripod on the second one. A customer came and I had to do a repair real quick sorry I'm shaky and uh, thankfully I got to use the customer zero turn this is just right across the street from me so I had to test the zero after the repair so I just brought it over here and used it to cut this thing down and it took me about 11 minutes so I didn't have to cut it by hand today And this gets cut every two weeks so it was pretty tall and it would have sucked to have to cut it to the push more but since my zero is you know down on the other part of town and I don't drive I have these two that I do for uh, for some elderly folks in the neighborhood basically and I do them cheap and I do them by hand Instead of trying to get somebody to bring my zero back here every two weeks. Just so I can cut two lawns. So that was nice. I like having my, my shop. I like having my customers. Because I was out cutting and one of my regulars dropped off a machine with a note. Hey, can you fix this? It was just uh, spindle casings in the front wheels. Easy peasy. But I just wanted to show you, this is the second house, this is the same battery, I haven't changed batteries, uh, and this thing's got plenty of power to clean off, I know I don't have to edge this property, uh, they don't care about edging, they just need it to be, you know, cut and weed eated, so don't harp on me about that. One day I'll probably bring an edger out here and edge it for them, but for now, I just come out every two weeks and, and 
back it down. But you can see that this Craftsman V20 electric blower has plenty, plenty of power. And you don't think, but it really doesn't take long to blow off a property. This is a big double driveway. 14 minutes gets me two to three houses on a two amp hour battery. So I carry two of those with me, which is enough to get five or six houses done. And I don't cut more than five or six a day. Uh, I'm going to get another battery. I just haven't had the chance. I've been doing too many repairs and haven't really had five minutes to think, hey, I need to run up to the store and get another battery or get one off of Amazon. But you get the point. This thing's got more than enough juice here. I'll put it on high. That's high. And it doesn't run as long. And I do want to show you when I'm done that I still have power left in this thing. Even after blowing off two houses. Two, you know, pretty messy. Pretty big houses. So I'll be back in a second when it's done. Okay, so I'm done. And I'm not sponsored by Craftsman or anybody else. This is just the one that was intermittently priced that I looked up that I said was worth a hundred bucks it came with one two amp hour battery and the good fast charger and you can see I still have some charge left and this was a pretty big double wide double long driveway um, patios and stuff in the back so <clears throat> if you're considering getting an electric blower I've been using it for about two weeks this is probably the 25th lawn I've done or so and uh, I'm happy with it. It's a joy to use. You push a button, it turns on. You push a button, it turns off. <clears throat> the fast charger charges in about 90 minutes. And, uh, you know, you see I just blew two properties off. I still have power left in one battery, and I still have another battery here. With a full charge. Just to show you, I haven't left the property to go home. But I still have a full charge in that one. So I got the extra battery. It was about 30 bucks. And I'm going to get another one. So thanks for stopping by. Hit the like button on your way out. Let me know if you use an electric blower, what brand you prefer. I've heard Ryobi's pretty good. Anyway, see you soon.